The Aramaic and Palestinian Targum, we're reading Leviticus chapter 3. And if his oblation be of the sanctified victims, if from thy cattle he offer, whether male or female, he shall offer it perfect. And he shall lay his right hand firmly on the head of his oblation. And the slayer shall kill it at the door of the tabernacle of ordinance. And the priest, the sons of Aaron, shall sprinkle the blood upon the altar round about. And of the sanctified victim, his oblation before the Lord, he shall offer the covering of fat which covereth the inwards, even all the fat which is upon the inwards, and the two kidneys, and the fat which is upon them, that is, Upon the folding of the cowl that is upon the liver with the kidneys, he shall remove. And the sons of Aaron shall offer it on the altar with the, sac with the sacrifice that is on the wood, which is upon the fire, an oblation to be received with favour before the Lord. And if his oblation of a uh, consecrated offering before the Lord be from the flock, whether male or female, his oblation shall be perfect. If he present a lamb for his oblation, he shall bring it before the Lord and lay his right hand firmly on the head of his oblation. And the slayer shall kill it before the tabernacle of ordinance. And the sons of Aaron shall sprinkle its blood upon the altar round about. And of the offering of his consecrated oblation, he shall offer the best of its fat and remove the whole of the tail close to the spine, the covering of fat which covereth the inward, even all the fat that is upon the inwards. And the two kidneys and the fat which is upon them, upon the foldings and the cowl that is over the liver, together with the kidneys he shall take away and the priest shall sacrifice it at the altar, the meat of the oblation before the Lord. And if his oblation be from the young goats, he shall bring it before the Lord and lay his right hand upon its head. And the slayer shall kill it before the tabernacle of ordinance. And the sons of Aaron shall sprinkle its blood upon the altar round about. And of his oblation before the Lord he shall offer the covering of fat which covereth the inwards, even all the fat that is upon the inwards. And the two kidneys and the fat which is upon them and on the foldings and the cowl which is over the liver, along with the kidneys he shall take away. And the priest shall sacrifice them at the altar, the meat of the oblation to be received with favour. All the fat shall be offered before the Lord. It is an everlasting statute unto all your generations that neither the fat nor the blood shall be eaten in any of your dwellings. But upon the back of the altar, it shall be sacrificed unto the name of Yahweh, the Lord. So the blood shall not be eaten, nor the fat. The fat is his portion. This is the end of the reading. I hope you enjoyed it. Praise be his name.